Hello and welcome on Stocks Advisor channel, here at our channel, we are looking for interesting buy opportunities for US based stocks. In today's episode, we will talk about Alteryx Incorporated, traded at New York Stock Exchange, ticker name AYX. Well, uh, Alteryx is a company that is that was declining, of course, two months. You can see that uh, from the level of about 140, we did decline all the way to around 80. Now we're 84.64. But what is important here, the chart is showing very clear signs of soon reverse and this should be very significant one so to understand those let's do a quick analysis here as always we have three moving averages depicted these are moving averages 20 50 and 200 here on the left you see their legends so if you look at them especially at moving average 20 this green line you see that it's starting to bend downwards so its deceleration is finishing and it is actually doing a move like this so soon it will start reversing really severely once this is happening this bounding of the moving average 20 and the overall declining stock especially when all three moving averages are 250 20 meaning that all three are one above each other so general decline once 20 starts to bound upwards it usually means a soon recovery you can see examples for those for example uh, by september by october here you see in december similar patterns especially december one is classical once it's bouncing uh, moving average uh, 20 is bending upwards it's going to grow but before that there should be a very small final decline you see it also an example of December price action here and the same you can see same pattern we just touched moving average 20 so we will most probably slide down with it slowly and then do a final rebound and this will actually make the strategy to play the strategy to go of other parameters that are important is also that rsi was already in oversold area now recovering still might do small let's say bounce down but then in general it is on its recovery mood and macd is now about to make a secondary upwards wave which will be also very nice for small slide down and then big recovery so everything tells here that soon a big move should be there at least till uh, let's say the level of SMA 50 which is now about 100 so it will easily make us our target profit which usually is 10 to 15 percent in our videos we always do analysis for those stocks where we look for this target and once it's there we take it usually also advise to you to do the same really take it make a strategy of let's say and the culture of trading with positive outcome up to 10 to 15 percent each time if you do it believe me in a year period you will make more than three four times because it's adding up non-linearly so with this being said how to buy here well it's easy you already need to buy in the current channel and the current uh, buy channel is here obviously anything between actually 85 and 80 this is a very strong entry opportunity and uh, you can buy anything there within it let's say to do this rebounds play and let's write it here also in numbers so it will be between 80 to 85 and 85 and with this being said uh, once it takes place the price will go higher and again the limit is the first limit is at least moving average uh, 50 to be more precise there are several limits uh, so one is of course just at moving average 50 currently because you also see there is another previously been support now will work as a resist line uh, R1 but also there is another volatility point which you can uh, still also need to keep in mind which might be a temporarily stopper of the price action it is about let's say 85 uh, 95 plus so anything between this uh, 95 plus so let's name it v1 line and r1 will be the target channel for us on this rebounds of course then if everything will be really good after having uh, let's say zigzagging correction we could go even higher but this and then return to the general trade let's say between 120 and 140 uh, but this is more uh, for later for now it's really about this bounce and this would be the first entry opportunity still just to make sure that we are not going to to lose if there is any further decline of course we need to see there is this descending let's say bouncing channel from where the price usually bounce let's name it r2 and should the price <clears throat> suddenly decline also this is still possible for one more as i mentioned also here uh, it could be still one more decline 
in this kind of pattern so if this is happening here it goes a little bit lower lower we need to be prepared so therefore anything that goes lower than r2 you can buy there in that range and if you look at it this should be actually somewhere about uh, 75 uh, let's say 70 75 so let's write it here as a second entry channel still possible due to a uh, major correction this will be 70 to 75 to enter again and then whenever rebounds takes place 10 to 15 percent from overall your funds allocated in the position will be the target uh, the, the target for the profit taking and if it rebounds no further decline is expected based on this technicality and the pattern but still if negative catalyst comes it's also possible so we need to make sure that we can mitigate with uh, negative catalyst kicking in because you never know when they come in which form it comes but if happens of course we need to be prepared but here uh, these levels are very close to 52 lows so it's very hard to say where lower it could go if a negative catalyst will kick in because just uh, quickly to give you an overview, if you look at the year scale here for the same position, you see we are already in those times where uh, almost a year ago we were in this the very deep depth of the COVID when it kicked in. So we are very, very low and therefore it's not really expected that we might go anywhere lower. But if happens, we need to take risk mitigation. And since we don't have any uh, obvious support resistance, we take it purely mathematically, which will be just... 15% from the current uh, low of the previous channel, which will be from, 0, 7, uh, from 70, and therefore it will be about 60. So the next level will be anything below 60. This is not prediction of the price action. Again, this is a mitigation of the, of the risks. So anything below 60, we can buy again here for risk mitigation. And here it's a still classical play will be one, two, two, meaning that the funds you would like to play here, you can split in five portions. And then you can buy with one portion in the first channel. Let's say you can average down first time with two portions in the second channel. And then you can again average down if it goes below 60 just for risk mitigation, while others will be taking losses. You'll be just taking your profit. Uh, on the recovery of this and with this being said this is the numerical card if you're more graphical representation you could look here and this makes it so-called uh, trading card which you can uh, save print screen or print out if you like and then use it as a guidance for your uh, trade if you like our opinion videos so with this being said that's actually all for Alteryx. overall very bullish momentum any moment could reverse a very nice stock so follow it and again once the profit is there take it up to 15 percent level don't be too greedy especially if you're a daily trader if you're not playing strategically for more midterm traders do it take it enjoy it re-enter if needed you can find plenty of videos at our channel even those that are up to five weeks ago four weeks ago placed still fresh meaning that situation discussed there especially if it is about second or third level to enter could be just in time to make your trade there as well. So with this being said, good luck also with uh, Alterix Incorporated and see you at another episodes of Stocks Advisor channel.